I try to create the rainbow in as many meals as I can, and I teach my kids that. We've all been told to eat plenty of fruits and vegetables, but what you probably don't know is that some actually get healthier when you cook them. Dr. Susan Wilder has a list of crops to heat up. First up, tomatoes. When you eat a tomato raw, you get a lot of lycopene, but when you cook it, you can increase, depending on the length of time, anywhere from 6% to 38% of the lycopene. But there is a bit of a trade-off. You lose some of the vitamin C value, but you're gaining the lycopene, which is even a more potent antioxidant. Yeah. Most like to cook this red powerhouse to make sauces, delivering a powerful boost. Very cancer preventive, especially for things like prostate cancer, which, you know, tomato a day keeps the urologist away. Next, carrots. Cooking these increases the carotenoids. Those other wonderful phytonutrients that help our vision, that help with our brain function, and help us fight off cancer. But don't go overboard. If you eat too many of those, your skin actually starts turning orange. Third, mushrooms. Heating them up hikes their nutrients, including vitamin D. Women who eat the highest intake of mushrooms have dramatically lower rates of breast cancer but organic are best. They do take up toxins too, so a plant is only as good as what it's fed, and same with an animal. Last, peaches. Cooking these sweet treats kicks their vitamin C and folate into high gear. To skip the stove, you can buy canned. They're already cooked. Studies showing that canned peaches hold their nutritive value for many years. So these are cooked, they're, they're in a can. Cooking up nutrients on the hit list.